Customers voicing their concerns tonight after they say animals not being taken care of at a local pet store in Batesville. We first told you about the Complete Pet Store East back in 2019. Jessica Rank joining us now from the store. And Jessica, the business dealing with the same complaints it had three years ago. Yeah, we spoke to a few customers who say their pets died just days after purchasing them from this store right behind me. Now their concern is that the animals weren't all that healthy to begin with and are asking for change. That's how big they are. It was supposed to be the perfect gift. They look like the prehistoric turtles in the zoo. A tortoise on the top of Kelly's daughter's Christmas list this year. When we got them, we were really excited. The Batesville native says she purchased the animals from Complete Pet Store East last Thursday. But within days, we took them home and the big one never moved. One of the tortoises died. Kelly concerned now the animal was sick before leaving the store. And my daughter's still crying. Thinking back, Kelly says she noticed a few red flags walking in the doors. This is where the turtles come from. She brought them from up under the counter. She says she was unaware of the mess behind the counter. Now taking a closer look, she says the animals are being treated unfairly. Oh, it was sad. There's dogs and kennels living in their feces like it hadn't been cleaned up. Other customers say it's been going on for years. They didn't care about the animals at all. They never have. Alice Richardson says she bought a ferret from the store a month ago, claiming it was also sick when she brought it home. He was not moving. He was acting very lethargic, like he was going to die. We reached out to the owners who say it's just part of business. It's a pet oriented business. And that they do what they can to make sure the animals are safe. The kennels get sprayed out daily. The animals inside get fed and they get water. Customers like Kelly say they still have questions. Before you sell an animal, you should make sure it's okay. She says she's hoping changes can be made before another animal suffers. Now, we contacted the Arkansas Department of Health, who governs pet stores like these. They say they are aware of the situation and are in the middle of conducting an investigation. Reporting in Batesville, I'm Jessica Rank. Back to you.